Citroen showed the Cactus concept car at the 2013 Frankfurt Motor Show. We've invited What Car readers along to have a look at the concept and to let the Citroen design team know what they make of the new style that will appear on future Citroen models. Here's what they thought of it. I, I, the simplicity, I do, I do like the simplicity of it. Um, I, I love the dashboard. Uh, this looks like it folds away, but it, it actually doesn't, but I do like it. Um, with the speedo straight in front of you, completely separate. But, Apparently everything is controlled from here, uh, electric fans and air conditioning, radio, all on the one touch screen. This seems very low, the, the um, windscreen, but looking at it, this is not how it's going to be in the production model because there's no central mirror yet and anything, um, and this is very bulbous. So I, I think the roof in the production model is going to be higher and give you a bit better windscreen. Um, but no, um, I love. I hope this goes into the production model, the bench seats. I'm not sure whether it will, but I do like it. It reminds me of the old days. I think it will attract a lot of buyers. From the back, it looks very much like a, a, a small uh, Evoque, and um, I, I think I think there's a market for it. Uh, yes, it's. Uh, but I am a Citroen fan. When my wife's car comes up, um, I, I, do, I will stick to my DS4 for a while because we do a lot of long distance. But when my wife's car comes up for renewal, this is the sort of thing I, would, I think she would love. I think she'd rather be here than me. I really like the fact that um, looking at this, uh, the Cactus was uh, the design concept of looking from uh, the, the outside of the vehicle. Uh, I think it looks like something that could fit on our roads today as is. And uh, I just think some of the different features uh, around the outside are, are the stuff that I really like. So I uh, love the wheels, love the roof bars. I think they yeah, just look, look great and really set the car off uh, really well. The big thing about it is the inside is what is massively different to what we see on the roads at the moment. And um, yeah, I guess uh, that, that front end panel, I think in that simplicity, uh, how user friendly that is, um, which is difficult to get a grasp from the, uh, from the concept vehicle. Um, but I think that'll be the big test for, for this car. I think the air bump is an absolutely superb idea, so simple, uh, something a little bit different. Why nobody's done it before, I'm, I'm not sure. I think, well, it could be slightly offensive if someone said they wanted to put bubble wrap around my car, but I think the fact that you can personalise it and make it um, yeah, unique to your car, you can change it if you want to change your car a few years down the line, I think it's a great idea and can protect you from those little uh, scratches in the car park. Yeah, it's great. Hopefully fun to drive. Uh, from the Citroëns that I've known in the past, from um, you know, sort of like a Citroen AX, that, you know, it was simple, fun to drive, and that's kind of what I hope to see in a Cactus. My cash guy kind of just blends in, um, you know, it can be four in a row, loads of your cash guys everywhere. So, yeah, it's, it's something different, stands out. I think it's something that people have looked twice at. Yeah, we're looking for a, a, a practical family hatchback, and um, I think it will fit into that market really well and be different and to stand out. There's a lot of features I like. I like just the uniqueness of it. You see it and you definitely recognise it. It's unique from any other kind of vehicle. Inside, uh, when I sat at the back, I felt a little bit cramped. I'm not used to sitting in the back of cars usually, but uh, it just felt a little bit like my head was a touching the top, of, top of the ceiling. I would like a gear stick, so I do like having a gear stick in a car. Um, but other than that, I mean, uh, it's a complete unique feeling sitting in the front. It felt like a sofa, so I felt like I was waiting for a movie to come on. Maybe I'd just like a bit more room inside. The, uh, the modern design of the front, which is a bit like the uh, C4 Picasso, is very nice. Um, the, the headlights probably be quite interesting, especially if they stay LED. Um, the interior is very, um, very different to other cars. The use of material on the doors and things like that is very nice. The headroom in here is a little bit limited. There's a, a bit here that's a bit in the way for me, and I'm not... I'm not a very tall person. I think if someone said they were going to go and put a, a bit of rubber down the side of your car, it would uh, concern you quite a lot. But on this, it, it seems to work. It, it suits the car. It doesn't look out of place at all. It's quite difficult to see what it would look like without it, really. But the C4 is the best car I've ever had, and I'm struggling to find a, a replacement for it. But I'd, I'd definitely consider this when it's a road version. It's, um, it's an, in, an individual car. It's quite nice. The new Citroen C4 Cactus is due to go into production in 2014 and is expected to stay as close to the concept car as possible. We'll keep you updated with more information as it becomes available, so keep an eye on whatcar.com.